TheBahamasWeekly.com presents our interview with Russian adventurer Sergei Morozov. Sergey, tell us when you started your journey. Actually, 5th of December, I started my around the world trip, uh, sailing trip. Uh, it's like last leg for rowing record preparation. Uh, after that, I wanted to row around the world. Tell us about your sailboat. And that's my 35 uh, CNC uh, uh, sailboat, 19, 1972 Haikari. Her, her name is Haikari. I didn't want to change name for new one. That's why I a little bit play with name. She is still Haikari, but she is my dream maker. What was your most challenging moment at sea? Between Halifax and Bermuda, it took almost three weeks for me, and it was hardest. I hope finger crosses was hardest part of my. A trip because because North Atlantic for winter time it's no good place for for fun you know twice it was twice when I s almost say goodbye to everybody because it was really rough weather and my cell still in Cape Horn actually just completely was broken and d doesn't work so take care of the cell steering guys who wanted to go open ocean Cape Horn is for river marinas, uh, ponds, jacuzzi, but not, not for open ocean. How has life been for you in Grand Bahama? When, when I came to Grand Bahama, I found it here, I was really surprised and I found, found here lots of friends. For me, it's like I came to big, nice family. When do you plan to continue your journey? Actually, right now I'm waiting for good weather for through Panama Canal and the Pacific Ocean and also actually unfortunately um, I spent uh, all my money in Bermuda for new sales it's completely new sales and uh, I spent more than 10,000 for one and a half months that's my completely new sales uh, I get it in Bermuda it's, it's really 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 good uh, offshore sales I'm really happy about that. And what about opportunities for corporate and individual sponsorship? On the, my back, I have first advertisement uh, sign. It's one website from from the Russia. It's uh, about uh, whole Russian banks. I'm really happy about that. But I still have whole boat and also sales. It's ready for another advertisement uh, signs. And if you'll be interesting to put some sign or uh, advertisement sign on my boat. You can fi reach me by this blog. I'm nicknamed Navigator, Navigator, Navigator Pirate. You can see my blog and also uh, Skype, uh, email and uh, in other connections. You can find out by my blog. So right now I'm looking for um, some uh, sponsorship for my another leg from here to Panama Canal and also across Pacific because because I can't sail away from here without money because just Pacific uh, it's will took some money but first step I need to through Panama Canal it's minimum three thousand dollars for boat like that introduce us to your captain that's my captain her name is her name is Celia Floridovna Mahimahi. She is she's actually pregnant. I, I get good news. She is pregnant from from local guy. Uh, so uh, next month, next month, I hope we will get Canadian slash Grand Bahamian kittens. What do you eat at sea? When we living in the boat, we eat everything. It's uh, Lots of uh, cans food, dry food, uh, f some fishing. I'm fishing always. When I'm sailing, I'm fishing always. But before I get to Grand Bahama, I didn't catch anything. I don't. I, I don't know why. It's too picky fish here. They 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 don't want don't like my baits. I don't know why. Maybe I need to buy some another baits. Sergey, what's the deal with this dried fish? It's uh, dry fish. It's mahi mahi. It's mahi mahi and it's uh, snapper, small snapper. I catch it, uh, catch this fish here, and just salt it and dry up. It's it's good like appetizers for beer, especially for colleague or sands. 
What's your source of electricity? I see your solar panel. With wind generator in Halifax, and they together make for me enough electricity for whole boat. So I can use my laptop, navigation lights, another laptop, radio, VHF radio, GPS, everything. So that's make enough electricity for me. Now we are inside the cabin. When uh, we are in the sea, I can't use electro electric uh, stove, of course. That's why I used the propane stove. I, I can cook everything on my gas stove. Also, it's, uh, it's working. What about fresh water? I take care of water by cans like that. I, I put everywhere on my boat bottles with fresh water, but before Pacific Ocean I need maybe two, three hundred liters more by bottles. It's lots of, but I don't have any uh, water makers because it's really expensive stuff. Uh, so I'll take care of fresh water, just bottles or small bottles, big bottles, something like that. And I know you mentioned earlier that you've sailed with your daughter. My daughter just called me a couple of weeks ago and uh, asked me to come to me and sail with me another part of uh, around the world trip from here to Australia and later. When you're in your cabin here, where do you actually sleep? When I'm sleeping, I put this table down and put some Matrasses, more matrasses, and I sleep especially on this place. But when it's crane too much, for for example, the different crane, sometimes I'm sleeping here. Do you ever get bored? Never bored on my boat. I have lots of what to do. I'm almost finished my book, and my logbook also. I need to take care of my logbook because lots of readers, readers around the world. I really wanted to read my blog, so uh, I promised them to put maximum is maximum information to my blog for my readers. If something change, I change course a little bit, uh, take take care of sales, and so after that I'll go to sleep again. And Sergey, thank you for allowing us on here to do this interview with you. Here's your chance to say thanks to a few friends. I wanted to say special thanks for my new local friends like uh, uh, Mr. Preben Olsen with his family, uh, Karen Clark, uh, Shona Bean with his family. I, guys, I really, really appreciate it because, because I feel with you like inside big, lovely family. Thank you very much, sir. This has been a presentation of the BahamasWeekly.com, produced by Mackie Media Limited. If you'd like to make a donation to Sergey, be sure to visit his website below. Our ending shot. Already empty. Okay. I need more beer for my trip. <laughs>